scholarship, but, but you like mm -hmm. to teach. And we've asked you a lot of times around here to teach a session, teach this class series, to mm -hmm. preach or do whatever. If you can't, with the kids going through high school, thank you for Jessica sharing. Uh, and all of the, the kids, I mean, they were going to remember this. Uh, uh, this will be remembered as, as well as any anything happened in their life. That, that you know, dad had the big send off and we went to Nebraska and they remember this. And so we just pray, Lord, that uh, this would be a foundation of something really good. And that they so we thank you, Lord, and praise you for that. Yes. Mm -hmm. This is December 18th, 2011. We're at Bethel Church in Richland, and we're here with the Stone family, and we wanted to bring you, North Platte Breen, our church family, along on this journey with us. We're gonna have a prayer time of beginning of one chapter, the end of another. We'll pray that you would be blessed by our experience this morning also. As a body of believers gathered here, we have a special privilege, and there's some people standing behind me that are related to this. We're going to send some people who we love away. And so I'll, I'll introduce those to you in just a while. And behind them are some of the elders who are at this particular service, all the elders in this service. Last night, we, uh, we as an elder board and some of the, and the small group leaders and some of John's family were there, and we prayed over John. We uh, talked about stories. John and Jessica, and uh, <laughs> this, is, this is very current as far as I know. Actually, I don't think it's quite like that. If you don't know where North Platte is or Nebraska, here's, a, here's another slide. You can see, there it is. It's a quite large city, as you can see. <laughs> there it is, in Nebraska. And I wish you could hear all the wonderful ways that the Lord miraculously set it up. There, there's a long, wonderful story of not only talking to the elders, and we knew that John was supposed to be a senior pastor, and then just the way it all worked and the way it continues to work out, which is a wonderful thing. So what we're going to do today is I'm going to ask uh, if any of you, Jessica, you want to add anything, or John, you can add anything right now. Um, you're welcome to do it spontaneously. But... Well, I just want to say that um, one, of the, one of the elders in North Platte and his wife, whenever we see her, she always says, oh, this is the Lord's doing, and it is marvelous in our eyes, which we've actually read twice this year in Psalm 118. But... It's something that the Lord put together and their elders had prayed that this would be done in such a way that only God could get credit for it. And it had to be God to move us to this so town. These are the two elders who flew in yesterday to be here who were part of that service last, last night. And we've because they went through hundreds of dollars of money to find Nebraska quarters. And then they, they drilled a hole in them so that we can stick them on our keychain. And so every time we pull out our keychain and, and we think, oh, I'd like to spend this quarter, we can because it's, it's stuck on there and we're going to pray for John and Jessica. So every elder and all the people last night have those. And so uh, anyway, that's, that was a great thought. So here's what I'm going to ask Brent, if you would, and, and elders, if you'll just surround them. And we did this last night, but just put your Heavenly Father, we come to you this morning as um, your sons and daughters in faith through Christ. Lord, first we want to praise you for who you are. We want to worship you as... The God of faith, we ask that you would bring us a man and a family in a way that you would only receive glory. And Lord, we praise you that you answered that prayer. Lord, I pray this morning that you would bless people here with a glimpse of a bigger picture of your kingdom. That Lord, we're believers in North 
Platte and in Washington and all around the world, people worshiping you through Jesus Christ, Lord, that you have for We pray these things in Christ's precious name. Amen. Amen. But you guys can hug them while I go on and preach here. <laughs> One interesting thought is when the two sites at Pasco and Prosser see this, it will be on January 1st, that's just the way that things work out, John will be preaching in North Platte when they see this. That's your first time.